Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with an FGO AMV reaction. Uh, this is another one of those AMVs that you guys have recommended to me. And uh, in the previous video, a few recommendations like you know were given in my comment section. I have like you know saved them for later and I'll be reacting to them little by little eventually. So this is another one of those AMVs that has been recommended to me by you guys. This is uh, called FGO MAD. Um, then there's something written i don't know what it is in japanese then it's called missing you now i have no idea what this is about and let's check it out and um obviously uh, the audio will probably be muted if it is copyrighted if it is not which has like very less chance of happening the audio will be uh you know kept on but like 99 percent chance the audio will be copyrighted so as always it will be muted and the link to the video that i'm reacting to will be given in the description box and i'll timestamp the whole thing so that you can uh uh play the original video alongside my reaction and you know watch the reaction alongside it so yeah let's see what this is about this is called missing you and let's check it out so here we go um start Okay. All right, a good start. Oh, that's. Oh, is this uh, Atlantis related? Yeah. Okay, there you go. Oh, this is an Atlantis related AMV. That'll be good. We recently played Atlantis very a few months ago, so. Okay, okay, this song. Who is the artist? Oh boy. Wow, this song, a lot of things happening. Oh my god. Where? Who is this? This song? Oh boy! Oh, this is... Oh my god, the recent event. Uh, we're getting a lot of Odysseus in the recent event. Oh... Uh, Wow, this scene was just, I was mind blown by this scene. Like, how beautiful it was. I feel like I've heard this artist before, I can't put my fingers on it. On oh, the Orion thing as well, oh boy, oh my god, look at him. Wait, who's that? Wait, is this like a manga or something? Like, oh, there you go, our bro, Mandicardo. <laughs> yeah, is this like a manga or something? Does Atlantis have a manga? Oh. Oh boy. I've heard a lot of people calling <laughs> Mandikata as Hachiman and I can see their like you know, like, you know resemblance. <laughs> like both appearance and personality. Wait, who's that? I need to come back here later on. That's Charlotte. And that's uh Bartolomeo. Who's this is Hector? Who's oh that's Achilles, okay. And there you go, Paris. Oh my god, look at this. Oof. My god. Oh 
Uh, uh, is that the con constellation? Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, I feel like this probably has a manga or something. Like these are like manga sketches we're seeing. Ah, oh my god, Jason. Next to Olympus, okay. Very soon, you know, like the Olympus. Uh, oh, it didn't work. Uh, my first story, Missing You, Love Letter. My first story, where have I, where have I heard this? This name is very familiar, my first story. I think I've heard some of their songs maybe. Like that's why it's probably in some anime opening or something. I I'll check it out after this. I need to. Okay. That's the end. Okay now, uh it's just a sec. Uh, okay, uh my first story, uh Hortensia Saga. I've not seen Hortensia Saga. Saga. So this is not the one which I. Where have I heard their song before? Just a sec. Oh. Oh. Okay. Golden Kamui. Okay. I. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Opening two. Opening theme two. Golden Kamui. The one where, which is done by, I think Sayuri and yeah. My first story. Yeah. I think that that's it. Yeah. My first story and uh, Sayuri, both of them did this opening of Golden Kamui season uh, season two, I think. Yeah, opening theme two. Uh, Reimei, it's called, and that's where I've heard him. Yeah, okay. This this group, like I'm familiar with Sayuri, but I didn't know much about uh, my first story. Okay, all right. That's why I'm. I was thinking like I've heard their this voice before somewhere, and there you go. Okay. Um. All right, this AMV. Um, okay, so this was a Lost Belt Five Atlantis related OMV, uh, AMV. Sorry, <laughs> AMV. And um, now one thing I, I realized, like I think like this probably Atlantis has a manga or something. We were seeing manga sketches, you know, like black and white sketches of these characters, and probably something like that. Like it probably has like manga. Like, like Fate. Fate has so like a lot of mangas and stuff and spin offs and i know you few of them but there are a lot of them that i probably don't even know about so th this is probably one of those and um, yeah okay so atlantis we have finished very recently and uh it kind of showed us the whole thing a little like you know bits and pieces of it and atlantis was probably one of the most emotional character driven you know story arcs of fgo i've seen uh like all the other lost wells and singularities were really good but i feel like lost spell 5 atlantis captured the whole character development thing and you know uh the story was driven by the characters which i don't think any other lost belt or singularity has ever been able to accomplish up until now we've seen a lot of great stories i loved shimosa so much but you know like i feel like in the character development department in the like you know uh what do you call it in the uh, story driven by the character department lost Bell 5 atlantis is the best it it surpasses everything and um yeah like as i said i've i there's a lot of the arcs i loved in fgo shimosa is one of them another one is lost belt 4 i loved lost belt 2 as well the whole norse mythology was something that i heavily enjoyed you know i don't know why but it was something like you know like like that that i very much enjoyed so much uh like so these these are great but character development department lost bell 5 atlantis surpasses them all and it's the best and i i, I love lost bell 5 so much atlantis so much it it had you know like all the characters were involved in the story that's something that a lot of stories are unable to do you know there's a lot of characters that kind of get forgotten or they kind of get left behind but lost bell 5 was able to involve each and every one of them and produce a good story where everyone has a role to play everyone and some characters that we never knew charlotte corday um paris i never knew about him as well 
Um, I never knew much about Hector as well. I never knew much about Mandicardo. I didn't know much about um, who else. Uh, or Orion. Orion was a new character, but we kind of knew about him. Still, Artemis we also kind of knew. But these characters who we never knew anything about. And one character was a character who we uh, didn't like at all. Most of us who has played Lost Belt. Like, you know, the, uh, not Lost Belt, sorry. Uh, the Piano Singularity. That is Jason. All these characters, they were put in the spotlight again. And some characters, we got to know a lot more about them. Like Charlotte Corday, Mandicardo. Some characters, they redeemed themselves like Jason. And some character were, like, you know, was able to uh, act as a hero. For example, Orion, Atiles. Um, every, everyone was a hero in their own way, you know. Um, Mandicardo. And uh, there are some, some characters who supported us throughout. For example, Charlotte Corday. Um, uh, Kiyome, Bartholomew Roberts, and yeah, like some characters were able to break through their, you know, like their personality restraints or whatever, like Paris. Paris was able to change and Hector was there to support him. him. And all these things, it was, it was so great, you know, Lost Bell 5 Atlantis was a, an amazing experience. And yeah, here we see in this AMV so many things, those uh, those animations of like you know the the whole thing with Charlotte at first with the knife, you know, the emotional the the whole emotional thing, Mandicardo be becoming a hero, uh you know like and becoming a friend, getting an actual person who he can call a friend that is master, and yeah like <laughs> as I was saying Mandicardo I've I've heard a lot of people calling him a Hachiman Hachiman from um uh, my teen romantic comedy snafu. And it's one of my favorite anim favorite animes, my team romantic comedy snafu. And <laughs> I, felt like, and I never realized it, but now that I look at him, I'm like, yeah, it's true. Like his personality is also kind of like Hachiman in a way, you know, the way he monologues most of the things. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I, I really re I realized that not only his appearance, his personality also matches. My god, Hachiman became a heroic spirit. <laughs> oh. Anyways, um, yeah, and Mandicardo was able to gain a friend, you know, like, the, and he was able to stand up. The thing that he was never able to do when he was alive, he was able to do after his death, after becoming a heroic spirit. And the whole story of Orion and um, Artemis, you know, it was a beautiful story. And the end was, yeah. Uh, Jason, sad, you know, in the end, he actually... Uh, what can I say? He, we've always seen him just running away, trying to running away, trying to take the easy way out. But now, nah, in the end, he showed he showed us that he was also able to do something by putting his life on the line. Yeah, and Paris, Hector, all of them, amazing. Okay, I feel like I actually just a second. Oh, another thing I realized in this AMV, there were a lot of paintings, you know, like uh, those paintings that you see in museums and stuff. I'm guessing these are like the original paintings of these, hero like these heroic spirits that we see. Like, I'm sure they have a lot of paintings and everything, you know. It's probably those type of historical paintings that were just like, you know, being shown. So that was interesting. I've never seen any uh, AMV do something like this. So that was interesting, as I said. Okay, I'm trying to find the one portion where I said that I'm going to come back again. I can't find that part again. Just a second. All right, this part. Who is this? It's like, is that Drake? I think that's Drake, isn't it? Yeah, okay. I was like, who is this character? This is most probably Drake. I cannot figure out her silhouette. It's a female, I think. Yeah, it is a. Uh, that's Drake. Yeah, that is Drake. I think that's Drake. I was like, oh, who is this character? I'm seeing her, but that's Drake. And after that, we all see that the next one is Mojizuke Chiyome. The next one is this one is Charlotte Corday. Yeah. This one is Bartholomew Roberts. Yep. Uh. This one is a Kyle's, I think. Yeah, that's a Kyle's. It's Hector. This one's Hector. And there you go, Paris. Yeah, okay, there you go. So that was Drake. I, I said I'm going to come back to this part because I missed that part. That was Drake. Anyways, 
and uh, yeah that was this amv fantastic um oh boy like if i actually watched this without playing lost well 5 i doubt i'd get these emotions that i'm feeling now so <laughs> context matters you know and uh, yeah that was amazing so that's it and that was my reaction to uh, an fgo amv this was called missing you uh, it was a, the song was uh, a song made by the, my first story who as i said i've heard before as well from golden kamui so yeah and it was great the music and the like you know the scenes and everything fantastic loved it that's it thank you guys for watching and as i said i'm going to react to more suggested amvs like this i have a few of them in my like you know saved later you know what whatever you call those list i've saved them in my list and those that have recommended to me and i'm going to watch them and react to them one by one as eventually and gradually so and if you want any other like you know recommendations you can recommend me but it'll probably take a little bit of time <laughs> for me to react to it uh but yeah anyways that's it thank you guys for watching if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed i uh, put out fgo content or fate related content like this once or twice a week and uh, yeah so be sure to subscribe if you're interested comment down below anything you want to say any recommendations you want me to uh, want to give me uh like you know just write it in the comment section and i'll check them out so yeah and uh yeah that's it so thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next fgo video that i make it'll probably be very soon and uh yeah within one or two days i'll make another video so see you guys then until then goodbye and have a nice day